All righty. If you love a tasty tomahawk, ribeye, or filet, medium rare, please, then you're going to love our food to go segment. That's because Strip Steak Waikiki just reopened their restaurant for indoor dining last night. So, what can we expect? Joining us this morning is the man himself, Michael Mina, founder of the Mina Group. Good morning, Michael, and big congratulations on that reopening last night. Thank you so much. Thank you. It feels great. I really appreciate it. Thank you for having me. Now, I know you have some very exciting new menu items, but what about some of the popular signature dishes that are returning to the menu? Well, um, in true form of what we are, you know, the name Strip Steak, um, you know, we continually source, you know, great prime meats, Japan, uh, Japanese Wagyu beef uh, from, you know, around, around the world. And um, we continue, to, you know, to do our signature style, which is the slow poaching but in butter and then broiling it in a 900-degree grill so it gets the most tenderness. And so the steaks are always going to be a highlight. And then um, everything from the, you know, some of my classics like the ahi tuna tartare um, uh, to some of the great, you know, chilled, chilled and hot uh, roasted shellfish, as well as, you know, we have a full sushi bar, which is also kind of fun when you're going to a steakhouse to be able to have that mix of steak and sushi. Now, what can you tell us about the new menu items that you created? Well, you know, we leaned much heavier into the Japanese influence. I mean, surf steak classically is an American steakhouse that takes a lot of Japanese influence, both in product and technique. And so you're going to find some really fun dishes. Um, some, of the, some of the ones that I, I absolutely love are like, you know, we'll do chicken piccata with yuzu, uh, with yuzu koju butter or katsu, pork katsu, um, dishes that you might not traditionally think of when you think of going to a steakhouse, but they fit really well within, within the menu. And I understand that you have a new beverage program that's rolling out. What can you share about that? Well, with the beverage program, you just have to come and try because there's so many, there's so many new cocktails. And, uh, and I, you know, me personally, um, there, you know, I think that one of the great things about being in Hawaii is the, all of the amazing fruit that you get. And so really being able to take a lot of this great fruit that you get and infuse it into these great cocktails that, you know, where you're using fresh juices. I think some of it you just have to come try. Now, Strip Steak Waikiki is at a beautiful venue at the International Marketplace, and I understand that you're planning to have live entertainment there? Yeah, live entertainment um, Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and as well as we'll probably expand it. But, um, yeah, you know, the live entertainment piece of it um, is, you know, what we want Strip Steak to be is that place that you can go to and you can be there all night long. You can go later in the evening and you can, you know, I think one of the things we've all learned with the pandemic is a lot of people aren't looking to make three stops in one night. They're looking to go somewhere and be that to be their, their place for the night. And so part of the live entertainment is so that when people do get to strip steak, they can feel comfortable being there all night long. And real quickly, Michael, are reservations recommended? Can people order online as well? Yeah, you can go online. You can go to michaelmina.net. You can go online and you can make reservations. There, um, reservations are recommended. Um, you can get walk-ins, but definitely, I would say, get make reservations if you could give yourself the best shot of getting in. <laughs> All right, there you have it, Michael Mina. Thank you so much for joining us this morning, and congrats again on the Thank reopening you. last night. Can't wait to go back. Thank you. Take care. Thanks All right. for having me. Bye. For more on Strip Steak or any of the restaurants featured in our Food to Go segment, just log on to k22.com.